Have you ever wondered what an NBA coach does before a preseason game? Well, if it's Raptors head coach Nick Nurse and it's the day before playing the Celtics in Boston, he's on a stage just outside of the city jamming with his former Harvard professor. Late Tuesday night, Nick Nurse joined his former Harvard professor and author, Charlie Sawyer, in his band 2120 South Michigan Avenue. I don't play with bands very often, but I'm, uh, this moment is a big one for me. I always kind of in the back of my head hoped I'd get a play with, with 2120 someday, and, and here we are. Yeah. Uh, the, the, uh, Toronto should uh, draft a drummer. <laughs> <laughs> Nurse took Sawyer's class, History of Blues in America at Harvard, virtually when he was the head coach of the Iowa Energy in the NBA's G League over a decade ago. I uh, was just looking to take some classes and um, master's level classes and came upon the extension school at Harvard and um, signed up and started looking at the classes and I said, ooh, geez, this one's for me, right off the bat, History of Blues in America, and away we went. Almost 15 years after the class, Nurse and Sawyer are still great friends. But what's been the key to their friendship that's lasted well over a decade? Well, the, the distance between us <laughs> and a certain appeal to be friends across generations. I mean, I'm uh, old enough to be his father, I suppose. Maybe. I'm getting up there though, so I don't know about that. Well, I, I got a head start on this. <laughs> Nick Nurse recently wrote an appreciation in Charles's new book about BB King that features never before seen photos that Sawyer took over four decades of the legendary blues musician. The concert that happened in the suburb of Boston was to celebrate Charlie's book launch. Well, everybody uh, would, would have said then and still says nowadays that jazz is America's great contribution to world music and to world culture. Uh, and then usually they say jazz and rock and roll and soul. And now they say and blues. How did that, uh, that uh, way of including blues as a distinct form become widely accepted? And the answer is B.B. King. Both Nick Nurse and Charlie Sawyer are hoping to have a book signing in Toronto in the near future. And with Nick, you never know, there may be a performance. Reporting for City News from Boston, I'm Lindsay Dunn.